Good afternoon everyone and it's a sunny yet windy day here in Makati City, Philippines and it's around 2 o'clock here so it's still a little busy on the street and that's the ever so famous jeepney and my dormitory, my neighbor is the Mormon church. Okay. And as you can see, it's a very good day. And I hope it won't rain today. So what I want to show you is these. So these are my rooted material. These are dragon fruit the red variety one okay there are two four six eight cuttings on one gallon container this one and i have another three here and another one gallon now they won't stay here for long because once they settled I'm going to put them in a larger container hopefully I can put them here I think this is a three to five gallon pail because I don't have any plot to put them into I hope I can have one someday so the problem earlier is that since I don't have a car I have to get them from one point ride a bus uh, traveled for at least 45 minutes because of the traffic and some of them were damaged so I have to cut them so from 11 cuttings they turn out to be 17 all in all now what i'm going to do that uh to them is that i'm going to let the end tip where i cut them dry for it for i think about a week and replanted them into the soil so they would grow again and hopefully within a year we can harvest some dragon fruit now these are very easy to grow so you just have to put them in the soil after one week if the condition is good they would try to grow some sprouts like this one and grow bigger and bigger and what's amazing with this is that they are like orchids so uh let me show you okay so for example, I have planted these cuttings into a pot, so it will get the nutrients from the soil and uh, they would get the extra moisture and other elements from the small roots here. They are also climbers, so if they can have a post that they can climb into, they would crawl and they would use it to increase their height and get more nutrients and more sunshine so i will gonna give you an update from another week or so and hopefully next year we can have some amazing dragon fruits so see you again bye bye